outside the restaurant Vapiano at Monroe and Wabash. This is not a door, but a printed picture of a door that replaces the functional door at its place. A fake door. The color at the bottom is starting to fade due to sunlight and rainfall. When pictures are life-size, they create a new layer of reality. Unlike painting in a museum or a photo on a phone screen, life-size pictures don't zoom into a detail or shrink the world into a frame. They're replicas of existence. They are not windows, not an angle to see the real, but part of the real as materials. Tongda Company uses the printed picture of a forest that is about 260 feet wide and 30 feet high in front of its stone machining plant, about nine miles from the city of Hebei, China. The printed forest covers the processing yard when people pass along the road. In spring and summer, the artificial green merges with the surrounding woods. I call this phenomenon space collage. Two-dimensional life-size picture installed in three-dimensional space. It can be a picture of a figure, a pop star, perishable food, jewelry. These pictures can be installed in a room, on the road, in front of a building. They cover the original setting and the reality that someone doesn't want us to see. However, at other times they restage and create something new altogether. This phenomena is purely visual. Raja Kailas mimicry and legendary psychostenia from 1935. Introduces Herman Foy and Aurelius' biological experiments. The larvae of mayflies fashion a sheath for themselves with twigs and gravel, and spider crabs haphazardly gather and collect the seaweed and polyps of their surroundings on their shells. These techniques depend on vision, since they neither take place at night nor after the removal of ocular peduncles. As visual animals, humans understand and are good at applying this nature rule. Space collage is mostly used in commercial spaces like an unfinished cafeteria or supermarkets around the world. The broad application of this trick relates to globalization and the modern economy. If camouflage is used to make existence disappear, what makes absence appear? Would be called decamouflage. When the commercial environment needs items to look beautiful and complete, decamouflage that binds with its context illustrates imagination in our heads. Due to low cost and advanced printing technology, these printed photos that serve temporary purposes are good solutions in many cases. In a Target store in Chicago. The owner put a picture of two bagels on cardboard and put the cardboard in the slot of a new type of toaster to show that the toaster has an extra wide slot for bagels or thick toasts. Despite the cutthroat nature of business world, can we take part in the modification and repair of public space and use commercial tricks to cover up some defects or? An attractiveness temporarily, because the Chicago neighborhood as a public space is less cared for than its private areas. All phenomena pass through a stage of being processed in the form of digital code. We cannot meaningfully distinguish between reality and its multiple simulations. They are all woven together in one and the same fabric. Life-size images can be found on the stage in the past and films more recently. They create special effects. Now, space collage is not only downgraded to reality level, but it also comes to the front from the back. Things above reflect how humans prioritize their vision, but different from the goal of immersive technology like VR, which is to make people. Believe in fantasy. This type of illusion makes things look better, but no one is being fooled. 
One can tell that something is fake when one can't apply all of the senses. Kayla argues space is indissolubly perceived and represented. It is awkward to see a piece of paper with images on it actually clashed with the surroundings. But that never stops people from accepting and embracing the illusion. The virtuality, the directness, and the cost of cheapness have embedded in space clutch. 福大道不称，道照而不道。庄子 wrote in his On Leveling All Things, two thousand years ago. Perfect truth cannot be given a name, for the truth which is manifest is not the truth. Likewise, when the illusion is obviously fake. It is not about trickery and fooling. The illusion doesn't serve the purpose of illusion. There are many versions of the story of drawing a bread to satisfy hunger. No one in the story ate the drawing of the bread, but that was the moment of ties of kinship. Space clutch strengthens people's binding, though it keeps a low profile. And follows the norm of the real. It is controlled and limited, tends to fit in than exceed. It is effective ineffectiveness, a true lie. On December third, twenty nineteen, Wa Piano fixed its doors. The story ends here. The fake door has gone. The new layer of reality has gone.